Hey guys, it's Amber and today I'm so excited to dive into one of my favorite things, Halloween candles. So everything in this video is from small shops and it's fall slash Halloween. Basically any autumn scents was what I was in the mood for. I know it is only July, but it's never too soon to start burning some autumn candles. So the first package I have, I actually ordered these online and it already smells really good. It is from the Sanctuary Candle Co. and they already put some cute goodies on top. It has a bunch of confetti. I don't know if you can see that. Probably not, but it's a little cat. And it has their business card. Such a nice touch. And it came with two Halloween stickers, so I'll definitely use these somewhere. So cute. Such a nice little touch. This is why I love shopping from small businesses. They always put so many cute little touches in there that you just don't get when you're shopping on Amazon or Target. So one of the first things is this little car air freshener. It is a little skeleton. It is so cute. This one I got in the scent, I believe it's Witch's Brew. Oh, it smells good. I wonder, I don't, I'm not sure if you can buy refills, but I know this was really cheap. This is about like $6 and I know once the scent runs out, I will still keep it in my car because it is just so cute. Ooh. They really wrapped these candles up good. I'm sure they sound lovely unwrapping on camera. <laughs> it feels like it's a holiday, like my birthday. I have all these presents. <laughs> so this one is Hallow's Eve. These ones are soy candles. They're eight ounces. Mm, and it smells so good. This is so cute even to show off and just put on a shelf. I love to burn candles and then keep the jars. So I will definitely be keeping this one. And it smells so good. I can't wait to burn it. I am already burning one of my candles. I could not resist. That one's a pumpkin chai. I got it in Salem. I believe they have them at the Salem Museum. But I got it at, I think it's called Why Nots. And it's like... A Harry Potter store and they have wands and it's so cute in there and everyone who works there is so nice I've been a few times and they always just make conversation ask how my day is going and it just always feels so welcoming in there this one is October and this one, its top scent is green apple, middle is cinnamon clove, and base is tonka. And it is a soy candle as well. I believe all of the candles from this company are soy. Oh, and that smells so good. The descriptions they have on their website are amazing as well. They just, I feel like from reading the description, you can smell the candle. <laughs> And then my last one. This one is The Harvest, also soy in eight ounces. And I believe each one of these was $14, which really isn't that bad. I have a candle somewhere around here that I paid like $25 and it is so much smaller than this. Oh, that smells so good too. It reminds me of like a hayride or something. So good. I will link them all in the description. So feel free to look at them and see the other candles they have. I know once I burn through all three of these, I will definitely be ordering more. I also got some candles at Witch City Wicks in Salem. 
I'm lucky enough to live like an hour and a half from Salem, so it's not too bad of a drive to go. And I bought two candles there. This one's called Ceremony. And these are also soy wax. And it smells so good. I don't know why, but it smells exactly like the store Ascend. Like when you go in there, it just smells like this. And it's, it's so good. I know, I was looking to see if it has any descriptions, but so good. And you can definitely order these online as well. I was fortunate enough to be able to go to the store, so I smelled every single candle in there, and they all smelled amazing. And then I got, this one's called a Witching Hour. I thought this was also so cute, the graphics that they have on here. And they are all hand poured in Salem, so it's always nice to support local businesses. In the, the Sanctuary Company, they're also from New York. I'm in Massachusetts, so I love to support some neighboring states. Oh, so good. I don't know how to explain. These ones are less like Halloween-y, but they smell like witchy and clean. They had so many options though, it was so hard to pick, but I told myself I was only going to get two because I knew I already had those three coming in the mail, and then of course I bought this one too. This one is pumpkin chai, and it just smells so good. It was also only, I think it was... Uh, $8, which I definitely should have bought more. I didn't realize it was only $8 or I probably would have <laughs> But they always have it burning in the store and it smells amazing and every time I'm like what, What's burning? It smells so good in here and then They always tell me which one it is and I feel like it's always this same one, but I finally bought it <laughs> I feel like I'm always buying so many things when I go to Salem that I'm like, I'm not gonna buy a candle because I buy so many. But it's so cute. It says, which you are here. And it's pumpkin chai and it just makes me feel like it's fall right now, even though it is like 85 degrees out and very hot. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe for more content like this. I know I don't have that many videos right now, but I do plan on making some more all related to fall and Halloween, my favorite seasons. So <laughs> subscribe if you are looking for more of that and feel free to leave some brands that you like or some small businesses in the comments that you think I would love because I love to check out small shops and support them. And yeah, I hope you have a great day and I'll catch you next time. Bye.